Last year, the Korean government through the Korea International Cooperation Agency issued equipment worth 300 million Kenya shillings to NITA's Mombasa branch with the hope of equipping the students with modern skills to drive manufacturing and affordable housing agenda. The funding enabled NITA to install ICT, electrical refrigeration and automobile equipment at the Mombasa branch. Okwaro says the 40 trainees will proceed for another four weeks in Korea to familiarize themselves with modern equipment which have been donated to NITA institutions in a bid to prepare learners on the emerging trends in the industrial market. You know you cannot do manufacturing, you can't do the area of housing unless you do areas like electrical fittings, areas like uh, building, uh, masonry and all, which is all being done here. And uh, the kind of machinery for those who came in and have seen, the kind of machine that is provided is not only it's not available anywhere in this area, this region. The equipment, which will support learners from all NITA institutions, are expected to help produce qualified learners able to support electrical workforce under the affordable housing. The equipment and training has seen the enrollment of 30 trainees from Madagascar. Fiona Shuru for Channel One Business News.